Welcome to my mother's channel. Sitting around doing some videos. Most of the time is happy. Bringing good vibes. Sitting around never sappy. Good vibes from the sky. Good vibes from the clouds. Good vibes from the rain. Children always feeling so happy. Bringing good vibes never sappy. She is so nice to me. Thinking about her family. She's awesome. I love my babies. It just makes my soul go from blue to yellow. Every single day, it makes me feel happy. Being around her, that's just what she does. She looks so pretty, so awesome, so nice. Bringing good vibes, good vibes to your soul. You and my soul feel so happy. Go watch your video. Go, go subscribe to her channel. Morning, beautiful people. I'm on my way to um, meet meet up with my son in a minute. I gotta grab some detergent. But how are y'all this morning? Y'all, I woke up this morning and thought of and thought to do to create. You know, that's what I did. I was still half sleep. Didn't even get out of the bed fully when I started it. But um, it was still slightly dark outside. But uh, yeah. I hope y'all have. But it, it 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 was best for what I was trying to do, so it worked out well. Anyway, I will talk to you guys as the day progresses. Come on. Good morning, beautiful people again. I just said good morning to y'all. I'm at my son's house now waiting on him. Um, but yeah, I don't really have too much to talk about this morning. Like I said, uh, I'm hanging out with my son. What's that about? <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Alright, I'll see you when, I, when we get back to my place. Alright. Yeah, do y'all remember these pants? I wore these in forever. I don't know if y'all can see exactly. Y'all see, they have the lace-up backs. I was like, today's gonna be a chill day. I'm just gonna be chilling, but all right. <sighs> What's going on, beautiful babies? I know I'm looking probably, I don't know how I'm looking right now. I tried to comb my hair, but you know, it's what it is. I was out with my son all day long and, well, between him, the kids, whatever, you know, we're doing our thing, whatever. Um, and, <laughs> uh, I got my results back as soon as like remember my results also be back Friday from the doctor of all the tests I took or whatever. So my I hit my doctor up today. I was like, oh, you said by Friday they weren't here. Well, most of them were here, but one. And I was like, okay. And then I didn't understand the anemia um, results. So mm. I just ate. I had fish. I had uh, Ethiopian earlier. Now I have fish. And, um, Sweet potatoes, but um, if I stuff my teeth, y'all please ignore that. And what the freak y'all at? Huh? Niggas, niggas. I'm sitting here checking my journal. I'm like, where everybody at? Y'all play way too much. But anyway, I love y'all still, but come through. Anyway, and hit your notification bell if you don't, if you haven't done that yet. Hit your notification bell. Keep up. Like, what the freak? Like, a, the freak you want me to do? But um, anyways, let me not be weird. So. Um, so he calls me my results. My son was in the car actually at the same time because we were headed somewhere because I'm wrestling with my son. Ah, I got a cramp in my foot. <laughs> and, um, so he's like, is now a good time? And I'm like, sure, absolutely, unequivocally, undoubtedly. You know, so he's like, uh, tell, give me all my results. My son's like awkwardly sitting on the passenger side because there's lots of results to come back. And, uh, everything's good, but my anemia is still fairly indecent <laughs> it's disrespectful so he told me to either continue my iron peels or he said i was like well, what can i eat he was like change my diet i was like what can i eat he was like green leafy vegetables like spinach he said but he said that's not the main or best way to do it he said uh red meats and let me go ahead and be honest i crave red meats like mother freak. i crave like bloody meats y'all know how i am about here like i'll bite the mother freaking cow don't play with me However, I don't always get those bloody meats. Those bloody meats are kind of expensive. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I do make this. Uh, I make nachos and stuff, but it's not the same. Even though it's still something. Um, so with that being said, I told him I said I'm gonna just go bite the cow. I was like, no, I'm joking. But I was like, yeah, I love. He was like, don't overdo it now. Nobody wants to overdo anything. He's so freaking cool. I wish he could be my doctor like forever and ever, and a day. But, yeah, he's filling in. He was filling in for my doctor when my doctor wasn't there. And I haven't met my new... Well, I'm not going to talk about all that. 
but he told me I need to eat more red meats. So for iron, my my extreme iron deficiency, which he said isn't the worst, but it's pretty darn steady. <laughs> it's not good that I need to eat more red meats. So my son hearing that, he's like, oh, I'm taking you for a steak. You know, he got things going on right now because his boo thing and stuff like that. We ain't gonna talk about that. But he, uh, besides that, he's gonna, he said after, you know, everything he's done is handled, um, because it's an engagement that is already arranged and it starts ASAP, um, he's gonna take me out to wherever I want to go to get the reddest, bloodiest meat I want. And the most expensive, he didn't give it F. So, and I was like, yeah, I want to go to that place that I went to last time. And it was some white place, not even expensive. It was freaking Outback. But I had like the steak. It was like a steak. I can't remember what I had, but it was... I had it so medium that it was almost rare and it was so good and when I I had my son try it and he was like oh this is too raw for me or whatever so he doesn't like stuff like that but me I feel like I crave those types of meats no well anyway, let me go back there. I feel like I crave those types of meats because of my anemia and I didn't get a chance to ask my doctor which I should have I didn't think about it at the time but I feel like yeah that's why I crave blood I crave blood like I crave blood and I'm not a vampire, so... <laughs> anyway, so, um, aside from that, there's a lot of places that are more lavish that he wants to take me, but I'm like, no, 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 this is... I want my bloody meats, but we will go to those places, too. And, um, yeah, because he's like, where I want to go, and I say y'all back. I'm a humble soul. I'm a pretty easy-to-please mother freaker. I just want the food to be good. I like Outback. I like Longhorn. I like, uh, Hibachi. I like... Those are the things I like. Like, it's not too much you know what I'm saying um not out of touch you know so <laughs> but uh those things however may work for other people for me I like I just like what I like you know but I'm willing to try the more expensive things or even the less expensive things depending on where we're going to who I'm with um I'm I'm open because I'm all about trying things remember I used to want to travel with mother again what's his name the bald head dude Andrew Zimmerman I think his name was I used to want to travel with him to get stinky tofu Y'all, I am open to traveling and trying new things. Well, not necessarily traveling, but trying new things. Definitely. Most definitely. So, um, some stuff you can't really tell me. <laughs> like, anyway, I'm not gonna get into all that. But I'm watching a chick right now. She ate mother freaking lizards. And I was watching her. She was capturing them in the end, preparing them to eat them and eating them. And I was like, it's too crunchy for me. But when I was telling my daughter, she said, I can't watch. You know I can't watch that because of our pets. And she's serious about it. And I respect that, right? That's not me, though. Like, I got lizard pets, right? I have a cat pet. I've, I've loved my auntie cat. My auntie cat had a cat that was like my aunt. You know, but I would still eat another motherfucking cat. Like, I'm just not that type of person. I'm not that person that... I won't eat my pets. I won't hurt my pets. Most likely. You know what I'm saying? Like, if it was like... In, like apocalypse or you know what I'm saying or something like that uh, yeah, I can't be trusted but if it's like regular times I'm just being honest it was like regular times and everything and so I'm not gonna eat my pet I love my pet well at least like them or at least like tolerate it so I'm gonna go ahead and respect my pet and take care of my pets the best I can right um and I'm not condoning people messing with it you know pets are freaking valuable and great Maybe I should leave this out. But I would not eat my child's pet. Unless there were some extreme circumstances that, no. Yeah, but I would not eat my child's pet. I would not eat anyone else's pet. I would not, whatever. However, I do realize that food is food. Meat is meat. You know, so it's just different. Some people may go extreme with that. It's, I'm not going to comment on that, but, you know, it ended days about survival. But, uh, anyway, much love, beautiful mother freakers. I'm about to watch her. Now she's eating, um, she's hunting down toads. Wait, let's see. Secret technique, cooking wild tarot tree with biggest frogs in wild. Grilling stuffed frog recipe. Let's do it. All right, y'all. <laughs>
I get on why my memory's so bad, but then my memory ain't that bad sometimes. Like today I remembered something. Look, if you looked up, look me up in the dictionary, if you looked the word mom up in the dictionary, it, you would see me. <laughs> I look like such a mom right now. Look at me. The outfit and everything is. Mom. Huh, honey? Would you like some muffins? <laughs> oh my gosh, you're such an idiot. <laughs> but my belly is outrageous and I don't give a ooh. I'm making garlic parmesan chicken for the first time ever and it's about to be banging. Let me just tell y'all, it's about to be bomb. It's about to be bomb, skitty gom gom gom. Y'all, it's about to be bomb. I was out just a little while ago getting all the rest of the ingredients I need for the, the garlic parm. And I saw this dude I knew and I haven't seen in a long time. He loves to talk. I had to walk around the whole other area of the store in the parking lot just to avoid him. And I hate that. I hate that I'm this, I'm this way, you know, and I don't dislike him. I think he's awesome. But he just talks so dang on much. And I just wasn't in the mood to talk to nobody. I wasn't in the mood to say hello to anybody. I'm just, I just, I'm just trying, trying to get to my garage apartment. I got, got home so messy in here. I had, I'm just going to stretch. Anyway, I will talk to you guys as the day progresses. All right. Mwah, mwah, mwah. What's going on, folks? My kids claim, claim, bleh, my children claim they never want to go anywhere, and then they just abandon me to go to the movies. Hey, what are you doing back here? What? She said something that matches. <laughs> <laughs> Not your inspector jacket. <laughs> you got a sweater? You got a sweater? Up there, just take a sweater. Okay. This is a black. I'm sure you got plenty. Oh, unless I put all your sweaters away. Probably did. Cause I put their stuff away, the summer stuff and the winter stuff, and then the next year I pull out what they can still fit. Typically, it's nothing they can still fit, but yeah. So um, yeah, they getting a, he's getting a sweater because you know the movie theater is kind of cold. But yeah, I'm still cooking my food, y'all. I'm still. Uh, but we'll talk while I'm alone, I guess. All right. And I was like, let me just show y'all what I'm doing. Hold up. Give me a second, y'all. I'm watching some really sad show too. It's like a doc, not a documentary. It's a really sad. Video on YouTube. I'm gonna share that with y'all probably. Wait a minute, hold on. Alright, so this is the chicken that I fried up. That is my parm sauce that I'm doing up real quick. I'm about to add the Parmesan cheese. Give me just a minute. I gotta give it a second because you're supposed to let the let it cool a little bit and then I'm gonna add the Parmesan cheese. Then I'm gonna drizzle it on my and actually I'm gonna mix it into my chicken and then I'm gonna Use this cheap ass as blue cheese because niggas really do be broke though. I got this blue cheese. <laughs> you know the store brand is gonna work. And I'm gonna drizzle this on top once I'm done. Store brand again. Alright y'all. So this is the end product. Now I'm gonna drizzle my Parmesan chest on it. And uh, yeah, I know I overdid the seasonings but I cannot eat unseasoned food y'all. I can't. But I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, now, so are y'all ready for the taste test? Hopefully my head is in the camera. Look. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and add this on here, the blue cheese, so I can taste test this dish. Out this my freaking plate dish. All right, so. Whew, let's get it, y'all. That was another seal. stay there for a second for a second baby for a second all right so let's get this in here make some room for the sauce the dipping sauce and let's see if i did a good job on that y'all ready to see i know i'm ready i haven't eaten all deer mm. all right so we're gonna try this one This is so freaking good. It's better than what Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm not even playing. Like, man, is bomb. It's because I'm going to skimp you on I love Buffalo Wild Wings. Don't get me wrong, but man, is way better. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my God. 
Can I taste the diabetes? Yes, I can. But do I care? I really don't. All right, y'all. Let me go in. <laughs> What's going on, beautiful people? I had to take a quick pause because I had to leave the house for a second. I, uh, <laughs> I took... It was so good. The, the um, What I made was so good. The wings that I took some to my son's house for him and his girlfriend. Okay, so what I'm curious is about, about is the camera cut off on its own. Yeah, but the wings were bomb. I hope they really liked them. I was just saying how I have the best kids ever. Like, I'm so freaking thankful. Like, I'm so grateful. I can never... I'm eternally grateful. Like, my family is amazing. That's just... Oh, Yo, I just am so in love with life, you know? <laughs> and it's crazy because my life hard as F, you know? And I'm broke as a mother freaker, but I'm crazy about life. I am so insatiably crazy. <laughs> like, like, it is an addiction for me, you know? So, yeah, but I was saying that I'm going to try to go hang this video up for y'all. I took my ponytail and stuff. I was, I was just talking. I don't know why I cut it off by myself. I'm sure it doesn't need to charge because I charge it all the time. But uh, I hope you all have a great fantastic uh rest of your afternoon evening and night i love you bunches when you mother freakers and i will talk to you guys later gators <laughs> see you guys in my next post